know what you're thinking. Finally, a movie that I've actually heard of. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, this movie is called Prime Evil. That's right, Prime Evil. Just came out, I think. Um, it's a story about the, the, the craziness that is Africa. That's right. It, the story revolves around this alligator. It's the most, or actually, crocodile. My bad, Steve Irwin. It's a crocodile. Um, it revolves around this crocodile named Gustav. I didn't make that up. It's Gustav. That's his name. That's what the locals called him. And the story, it's like, it's about the crocodile who's caught up in the mix of this civil war in this uh, village community in Africa. And it goes pretty much like that with the, the civil war going on, but you got this crocodile who's in the way of just, just eating people. He's killed like 300 people or something since 1908, I think they said. He's been around for like 100 years because he's a dinosaur. I mean, this is like the crocodiles are killers, man. He's, he's been around. And, um, it went like that. This, this group of reporters went to Africa. Uh, the lead guy was the dude from Prison Break. I don't know if you've seen that show. I never have, but <laughs> it's him. And uh, there was some lady. She was the reporter. And then uh, Orlando Jones. Funny guy, funny guy, funny guy. I love him to death. Um, he was the cameraman. And uh, they went to Africa to get the story on Gustav. So they, they were over there and they're caught up in the Civil War too, you know. And Orlando finds out firsthand that what well, his character does that African people don't like African Americans, and it's it's you know it's just the way it is. Cause I won't get into that, but um, it's a movie review. I'll stay out of I'll stay out of history and all that good stuff. Um, but they go over there and uh, they they start finding stuff on Gustav. They hook up with this hunter and they have this army escort. And, well, I won't give it all away, because this is actually a good movie. It's not like the other stupid crap I do that you're never going to watch. You might actually watch this. They go after the Gustav dude, though, and, and um, they, they have their troubles. He eats a lot of them. You know what's going to happen. I'm not, I'm not, honestly, I'm not going to give this away, but it's a good movie. Um, it kind of reminded me of Anaconda, because I loved Anaconda. John Voight was crazy in that. I loved him. And um, it was kind of like that, you know, good writing. The writing was awesome in this movie. It's so funny. Orlando Jones is, like, the funniest. He was making all these jokes about ha being happy about slavery and stuff because it got him out of Africa because he hated it after this with Gustav and snakes and, and, and leeches and all this crazy stuff, people shooting each other. It's, it was funny. It was funny. And um, that was it. It was, it was good. The Civil War actually ended in 2005, they said, in May 2005. Good old Gustav, doing his thing, Gustav style. <laughs> Steve Irwin, oh man, I'm surprised he never did. I, I think if Steve Irwin would have lived a little longer, he probably would have got around to chasing this bad boy. But, I don't know. The world may never know. If that Stingray didn't get him, Gustav would have. The way it goes. You die for what you love.